Kaboom! Yes, welcome to our channel guys, and today we're going to be checking out a nice and easy to use Town Hall 13 attack strategy. We've got Super Dragons, Apprentice Wardens, and Bats. So we're going to check out some replays in just a moment. First of all, yes, let's have a look at the army composition. Six Super Dragons, two Baby Dragons, two Apprentice Wardens, two Rage Spells, three Freeze, and six Bat Spells. Clan Castle Troops, two Yetis, and three Sneaky Goblins inside the Battle Blimp. So here we go, on to our first attack. And we're going to be taking on a Town Hall 14 base. In my clan, we get lots of wars, but sometimes the bases I have to attack aren't maxed out. So I thought to demonstrate this attack, I'd go for a Town Hall 14 base, which is nearly maxed out. It's a friendly challenge, but you can see how powerful it can be. So you've got the Apprentice Wardens. And what we want to do first of all is do a bit of funneling. So we've got the King on the left-hand side there with an Apprentice Warden. We put some baby dragons on sort of center and the right. Then we're sending in the main army. Queen's over on the other side with an Apprentice Warden as well. So I've used those Apprentice Wardens with the heroes to help funnel. There's the Super Dragons in the center with the Grand Warden on air mode. Send in your Battle Blimp with the Grand Warden. Use the Grand Warden ability to protect it. Battle Blimp will make it to the Town Hall and then use a Rage Spell to help the troops take out the Town Hall. Goodbye, Town Hall. Thank you very much. Then you've got the Bat Spells. That's the last stage of the attacks. The first stage, funneling. King one side, Queen the other, or King and Queen together with an Apprentice Warden, Baby Dragon on the other. Main troops in the center with the Grand Warden on air mode and then send in your Battle Blimp. Send in the Bats when it's safe to do so. On this base, I'm being honest, there were multi-infernos everywhere, wizard towers. It was difficult to send in the bats. So the bats haven't been as effective as I would have liked. And of course, guys, you've got the royal champion as well. Try and send her in when it's safe to do so. What I mean by that is don't send your royal champion against enemy heroes apart from the Grand Warden. Because if the royal champion runs into the king, the queen... It's not going to go well. And watch out for single target infernos, of course, and monoliths if you're attacking a Town Hall 15 base. We're doing okay. We're getting as much percentage as we can against this nearly maxed out Town Hall 14 base. We're going to get over 80%. I'm happy with that. And the Grand Warden did a great job there. So we do have another replay, and here we go. So we're attacking another Town Hall 14 base. Pretty decent base. How can we do against this? So Baby Dragon on the left with the King and the Queen and an Apprentice Warden to help out. That's our funnel again. Then we're sending in the Super Dragons in the center. Baby Dragon on the right. Baby Dragon has gone. Super Dragons on the right with an Apprentice Warden to help funnel. We need to get those Super Dragons into the base. Grand Warden on air mode. Use the ability there. And the Battle Blimp is on its way towards the Town Hall. Rage spell there, free spell as well if we can to help take it out. But there's a tornado trap there. I think we're going to be okay. The priority with Town Hall 14 and upwards is take out the Town Hall. Town Hall 13, yeah, the Town Hall still does damage, but it's not as bad as that poison spell left behind. We're going to use some bat spells in the center of the base. And just to confirm again, guys, why I'm attacking Town Hall 14 bases is just to show you how effective this can be. Town Hall 13, of course, it still works there. I just couldn't get you the replays because in the war... Uh, I don't really come across many maxed out Town Hall 13 bases. So I thought I'd just show you this against Town Hall 14. As you can see, 80% attack, 70 plus percent attack. And we're nearly going to be able to three star this base. Yes, some of the defenses aren't maxed out. But just showing you how powerful it can be. And guys, do remember to hit that subscribe button and notification bell. Join the Samus Army if you want to see plenty more Town Hall 13 attack strategies. If you've enjoyed the video, please do hit like. And of course, let me know what you think in the video comments. So guys, we're going to finish up the attack now. The Grand Warden saying, don't worry, I'll just get a few more percentage for you. And guys, what I like to do at the end of my videos is give you a secret code word to put in the video comments. So I know you're still here watching the video near the end. So today's secret code word is Otter. O-T-T-E-R. The little sort of animal that lives in rivers and stuff. Lovely animals. That's the secret code word today. Okay, guys, hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you later. Bye.